So I've been doing this 30 plus years, you guys, and we clean French drains every day, whether they're wrapped in fabric or not. Debris gets into that line and it needs to be maintenance. We recommend every three to five years. That's not why we install a catch basin. That has nothing to do with this. Catch basin grabs immediate surface water runoff. Take a look. It's kind of like this would be a catch basin and somebody's telling you that this is to an access to clean the line. Well, of course it is an access, but that's not why it was installed. These are installed to pick up surface water. And you can see this is on a deck, on a patio, right here. When it rains, water pours directly down into the system. It has nothing to do with cleaning out the line. So just keep that in mind. These lines, these drains, they need to be maintenance every three to five years. That line actually runs out. We installed that. It runs out here and over the seawall. And we clean this line every three to five years, so there's never any problem. What a great system. If you maintain that system, yes, it will last forever. So the other thing we're gonna do here, Chuck's already done it, but he's gonna run it again, is we're gonna run the jetter down this line right here and because it was full of sand. This is our mini jetter, and it really is a great little cleaning device. Let's get over here, go ahead and get started. You get the hose started down the line, And then you can kick it on and it should pull itself through there, which it's doing. Looking good. And you can see that that line's looking really good. Looks like the water's coming right out of there. Looking good, looking good. Taking all of the hose. And this line will show you where it goes. Come around. It comes around this wall and begins right here in the catch basin. And you can see he made it all the way over here, no problem, looking really good. What a great tool. Jet, it's perfect for cleaning out sand and debris. It also cuts a few roots, but mostly it's for the sand and debris. So if you let that jetter run as you pull it back, it pulls back all the debris. See all that debris, the sand and the mud? It just pulls it all back. Keep it running the whole time. Pull it all the way back. Almost here. You'll see that, see the spray coming out so we know we're right there. Perfect. What a great cleaning device. So we're also gonna run the jetter down this line right here. And you see there's a pipe right here. We're gonna send that jetter down this line to clean this to be sure because when where we're at here in Florida, there is so much sand. I mean, it's Florida, right? And if there's a problem with your system, you need to maintain that drain. When that sump basin, if, if it fills up with sand, the sump pump's gonna suck it out. It's gonna suck it out. These pumps that we install are so powerful, so powerful. And they'll pump that sand down through your line. So it's always best, if your power goes out, that you have someone come out and jet the line. Sending the drain cleaning cable down there is pretty good, but the jetter is what pulls out the sand and debris. It works so good. Can't say it enough. It's what you need to have done. And maintenance of drains, French drains, especially French drains. Um, all this talk about no debris getting into the line, it is such a bunch of hype. <laughs> there, debris gets into your line, sand, clay, it all gets through, it gets through the fabric. And it doesn't matter. That line needs to be maintenance. Catch basins are not how you maintenance a line. You maintenance a line by cleaning with a jetter or with a drain cleaning machine, which you've seen us do thousands of times. I've got hundreds of videos up there showing you how to do this. Very important, you guys, very important. So we're gonna use the quick connect, and we've hooked up our jetter. You can see the hose out here. Usually we have it on a reel, but we just used it. So we're gonna go ahead and put this on here. 
Then we're gonna stick that jet nozzle down into the drain. He's just putting away another nozzle. Then when we, when we kick on the, with the wand, we turn it on, it'll almost pull itself through the line by itself. It, it's quite quick. There it goes. You can see how quickly that goes through there. A great tool. It'll clean this line out in no time at all. Like I said, usually we have it on the reel. We just used it. But see how it pulls itself through there? It's going great. So we just ran 50 feet in just a matter of seconds. Now the secret is, the secret is to make sure you keep it running, keep your wand on, keep it in the on position as you pull it back. Because we want to pull back the debris. You can see it's kind of hard because it goes back in all by itself, but just keep it running and pull it back all the way. When you're out here at the street, it's pretty easy. You can just walk backwards or you can get the reel, which we, I'm not showing you, but you can use the reel and it'll just reel it right up. But pull it all the way back until it pops out of there. Just pull it all the way out so I can let it fly. It's going to pull it back, and you'll see what happens with this jetter. You can see all the water, see all the debris coming out. Very powerful on the back of the nozzle. You see it? And it just flies. It's so powerful. What a great, great tool. What a great system. Yes, a French drain will last forever if you maintenance the line. Otherwise, it's going to back up. It's just a matter of time. And the more you maintenance, the longer you're going to get, the longer the life of the drain. So. Again, 30 plus years I've been doing this. Um, I give one more example and I'll be done talking about this, but you know, there's a company called Roto-Rooter and it's like, how could they be in business if there weren't drains to clean? They've been around since 1940 and they have you know, thousands of trucks across the US. I'm sure in your city, you see one of their trucks every day and nothing lasts forever. Keep that in mind. Like I say, these guys that are saying this, they're doing, they're doing great work. They install drains, but they really don't understand the maintenance that's required of a French drain. It's probably because they've only been doing it for a year. And they're gonna find out when that customer calls them back and says, hey, this is backing up. They're gonna need to be able to clean that drain. And I don't think they have the capability of doing that unless they go buy a machine, so. Hey, this is Chuck with Apple Drains reminding you that if you believe you can do something, I guarantee you can do it. Have a great day. All French drains need maintenance, whether it be a footer pipe down in the crawl space or a French drain in the yard. You need to clean these lines. get so many email requests now asking for Sideshow Bob, we decided to go ahead and give him his own French Drain channel. Check it out in the description box below, Sideshow Bob.